Minister blasts U.S. for alleged support of opposition in Zimbabwe elections. Zimbabwe's Minister of Foreign Affairs and International Trade, Frederick Shava, has accused the United States of revealing its support for the opposition by expressing discontent over the ruling party's victory in the disputed August 23rd and 24th elections. Shava's comments came in response to recent travel restrictions imposed by Washington on Zimbabweans accused of election rigging and political violence leading up to and following the polls. Although election observer missions, including the one from the Southern African Development Community SADC, noted that the elections failed to meet local, regional, and international standards for free and fair elections. Shava dismissed these concerns, suggesting they were merely a result of sour grapes. They, the United States, will always be ranting whenever they feel that their allies are losing ground. We have not done anything to the opposition except to present ourselves and them to the people. Shalva stated during an interview with Newsday on the sidelines of a Diplomat Training Institute's handover ceremony. Shalva further emphasized that the preference for the ruling ZANU-PF party among the electorate determined the election outcome, adding that the U.S. claims of interference were baseless. The cry that they want to punish people who are preventing democracy from taking place is their own cry. It is not our cry. Shava remarked, 